I get the people who've got start-up loans coming into Downing Street and telling me what they've done, often giving up a well-paid career, taking a risk, having a punt, having a go, that pumps me up, and it's what is changing our country. Because there is an entrepreneurial, small business revolution taking place in Britain. And if you think I'm going to roll over in the next 10 days and let Ed Miliband and Alex Salmon rack that, you've got another thing coming. We've got a fight on our hands, and we're going to win that fight. We've got a battle. It is a battle for the backbone of Britain. That's what this election is about. Labour think they know how to spend your money better than you do. They will put up your taxes. Labour think they know how to run your businesses better than you do. They will put up your regulations. You know what they call you? They say business is a predator. This is not some Arnold Schwarzenegger movie. This is what we're staring down the barrel of in 10 days' time if we don't get out there and fight for jobs and fight for enterprise and fight for our economy. And that's what we're going to do. And if I'm getting lively about it, it's because I feel bloody lively about it. That's the truth. Yes. If you want to take a risk, if you want to take a punt, if you think the last five years have been a waste somehow, go with the other guy. That is what he's offering. Is a, ch and a change to what, I'm not quite sure, but it's a change. That, that's the option. And so I want to be very direct with people. And don't vote Liberal Democrat thinking, well, I'll probably end up with David Cameron. You won't. You'll probably end up with Ed Miliband. Don't vote UKIP thinking, I want to make a point because, you know, some of the things in the last five years have annoyed me. If you do that, you'll end up with Ed Miliband. Don't vote Labour. You definitely end up with Ed Miliband. <laughs> <laughs> you know, in the end...